So today we like, don't judge me. Well, gee, don't judge me. But today we blame God for everything and no one's blaming the devil for anything. We come into a place that time is running out. Time is running out. Time is running out. And I don't want to miss the JC train. I want all. I want the crumbs of the master's table. I don't live in patterns and cycles of the devil. I live free. I don't owe the devil nothing. I owe Jesus everything. Even when the witch from St. Croix showed up, see, I don't speak like a Christian. I'm off the boat. I'm a radical Christian. I'm off the boat. I don't live in the conservative side. I live on the wild side for Jesus. So when the witch showed up and pointed his finger in my face and he said, I came to destroy you, I understood that he would talk my territory. So I said to him, what you said? <laughs> And he said, I came to destroy you. I said, say that again? See, I already knew I had him off balance. So when he came, he said, I came to destroy you. I said, let me ask you a question. And he said, what do, what do, what do you want to ask me? He was getting heated because I wasn't playing into his game. I was drawing him into my, I was drawing him over to my side. So I said to him, do, do you bring all your weapons with you, all your spiritual arsenal with you? And he said, what do you mean? I said, I got you now because you lost a step. See, and then I, I said to him, I'm here for three days. You can come back later if you don't have everything you got. I said, you can come back later if you don't have everything you got. He said, what are you talking about? I got everything. I said, did you got this, this, and this, and that? I said, because I'm here for three days. Because when, I said, I want, to, and then he said, what do you mean? I said, because in 30 seconds, I'm going to open up a kind of whipping on you. I told him. And I wanted to be, a, I don't want you to think it was a fair fight. So I want you to go get your stuff and get you all your arsenals and whatever principality, whatever, whatever principal is running your region, make contact with him, but you're going to need it. And he said, you don't speak like a Christian. That's all. At this moment, it's spiritual warfare. There's no rules. <laughs> There's no rules, baby. There's no rules. That means I have legal rights to open up a can of whipping on you like you never seen it in your lifetime. So you ready? He said, I'm ready. I grabbed, I put my hand to five four ministry. I hit him right here. <laughs> that brother dropped. He dropped on the floor. And he started turning to a snake. He started to swerve like a, like a snake. And he was foaming his mouth. His eyes went back. And all you saw was the white of his eye. <laughs> That's okay. I'll talk to you later. I pray for a whole bunch of Christians. And Christian, oh my God, he's going to die. Are you going to pray for him? I said, not now. Not now. I, 40 minutes. I prayed for all the believers. And then I came back to him. Did you give up? Did you give up? I said, I'll be back. Because you see, I am the church of Jesus Christ. Wherever I go, wherever I go, I'm the church of Jesus Christ. No weapon. No weapon, no weapon, four against me, or you will never, ever, ever prosper. I don't care what you bring, devil. I don't care what you say. I don't care what you got. But it's not what you throw at me. It's not what you throw at me. It's what I do about it. It's what I do about it. That's right. You don't want none of this. See, if I've been with Jesus, who are you? I seen too much in God to doubt and fear. We need to come to a place. Are you sold out? Are you sold out? 